talking today about homelessness in America and uh, what can you do to help yes or maybe people. maybe not <laughs> a lot of people yes what can you do to help what do you do when you see them what is your reaction yeah now <laughs> we we're gonna get into it in a little bit but you know um, how was the weekend let's, let's get into that my um, weekend? Yeah. My weekend, was, my weekend was um See, I realize I need to start turning down a little bit when it comes to the food. Because now people uh, are like, wait, wait. People, uh, every time I'm bumping into somebody, they're like, yo, bro, what's going on with the weight? What's going on with the um, with, with the size? Like, you're eating on time. I'm like, yeah, I'm having fun. I'm living life. So, my weekend was another food filled fun weekend. Um, okay. I could definitely, that's what I could definitely say. I had a lot of events to go to, get, get togethers. I went to yesterday. And then Friday was not to get together, so just food. I'm always around food. It's yeah, we don't food. need to. We don't need to change that. Matter of fact, I'm gonna do a show about fitness, and we gonna get somebody in just out. to help you out. No, you ain't gonna be out that day. You gonna make there. sure you here that day. Anyway. <laughs> How was your weekend? It was cool. Um, I actually went out Friday with one of my girls. You know. No, 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 you know, I haven't been out to the Haitian party in a minute, so. Um, yes. You know. Oh wow! I can't forget this. Well, I'll, I'll continue after you're done. Okay, and uh, went to see Transformers. Transformers. That was great. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, Transformers. That movie. It was like action packed from like beginning to end. Oh. I was getting all emotional and stuff, so it was a good movie. Wow. You know, you know how I get. Oh, <laughs> so. Okay. You know when you when you go to the movies and you actually want to jump in the screen and like slap somebody because you know you don't like them. <laughs> yeah, so oh, you know I'm one of those people. I try. Were you talking? Were you talking no. in the theater? Like, Where you going? No, nah, <laughs> a, a little bit. I was trying to trying to keep it you know uh, down just a little bit, but uh, yeah. So I've never seen a Transformers. Never. Now what? Nah, just, Violation. Uh oh. Yeah, I never. Oh, hell never went no. to go see one. Yeah, that's, that's, I, that's, I know there's more people in the world out there like me, but just never. One day, one day I'll let you need to, to go get that. How many? There's, there's, like, there's like five of them now. Five for what? And what I know five? if but, it was so good, it wouldn't need five. Yes, no, because you know, well, see, if you follow it, you know the cycle continues. I know there's gonna be another one. There's gonna be another one coming out because after the way it ended last time with you know Gavatron and you don't know, so I, I won't Gavitron, get into it. You know the characters. Oh, well, man. <laughs> and so <laughs> wow. well. You know, that was that. And um, another little highlight of the weekend was I finally got to see Princess Gianna um, because somebody kept saying that I didn't see the baby yet. So oh. I finally <laughs> I finally went to see the baby. And she's so cute. <laughs> and she was smiling at me, so I think she approves. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to AKA DJ Gigi. I'm checking. <laughs> yeah, so that was pretty much it for the weekend. Um, I almost forgot one of the biggest things we did was the health oh, fair. Oh, yeah, yeah, in Prospect Park. Yeah, we was in uh, Brooklyn. Brooklyn! Yeah. You can't say Brooklyn without saying it like that. Bro oh, yeah. <laughs> Shout outs to. Um, Shout out oh, to um, Ayana, oh, RBK Social. No, 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 this, this, the lady that was doing Beads of, Beads of Hope. Hope. Beads of Hope. Yeah. Um, Beads, B E A D S underscore. Of underscore hope, I actually bought a few beads of hers. Yeah, they were nice. I actually saw a couple yes. of them. I'm, I'm trying to figure out how come I didn't get anything back, but um, that's all right. Talk to like, you. Like, talk, talk to well, you. he wasn't there. He wasn't there. Talk, talk to <laughs> but um, shout out to the um, beads of hope. They you're have, my partner. When you go to events, have, you're supposed to bring something back to the station. Uh, see. Okay. see? Uh, anyway, shout out <laughs> to uh, shout out to um, beads of hope. They had a nice health. Fair when they had um, different sponsors come through and present themselves. We present ourselves at radio. Um, they had Advocate there. They had Emblem Health. It was a nice event. Different. Uh, they had actually uh, even a um, a sex education 
person there too. Oh really? Yeah, I got like a whole bag full of condoms and lube really? that she just like threw. You, you really? Like, like you need it? You need it? For protect? Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, um, you already like. No, pre prevent for the next one. Want to clean this one now? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, sure sure. Them. Make sure you look them up. Beads of hope. You got a lot of nice. A lot of nice accessories, nice kids for affordable price. Okay. All right. Um. Yeah. So, of course, you know, I don't know if you wanna just get into. It. You wanna take a little bit of music break and come back? No. Or we wanna get into. We get into. Okay. Matter so, of fact, you know what? Let me pull up a chair from my. I got my partner in here. He might chime in too. Yeah, I don't know him. So okay. We, we gonna introduce. <laughs> we gonna introduce you right here. Wait, we gonna have to readjust something before he. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. We gotta readjust. Oh, you readjust the camera? Yeah. Okay. All right. So you wanna go to music? Oh, you want to do something? Oh, no, you know what? Let me, let me set it off right you quick. You want to set it off? I think I need to set it off right quick. All right. Um, let, me, let me get you. Because there are a couple of things that, you know, are in the news right now. I want to talk about. Plus, you know, the regular set it off. But I definitely need to uh, just say a few words. And I'm about to set it off in um, these guys in the next room. If they don't shut the hell up, I'm about to set it off on them. Wow. <laughs> Y'all need to tone it down. Where's the, the radio on air sign? Hello? Y'all need to shut up. Tone it down a notch. Okay. Is there is that sign on? <laughs> okay. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yeah, so um this week, I'm not gonna go too hard, but a couple things just uh came up mm -hmm. before I came into the station. Now, okay, the first thing, I'm going to just get this out the way. You know how I am about hygiene. You ever seen that movie Outbreak? Yeah, with, um... I don't remember how long ago this movie was, so. but people who sneeze and don't cover their damn mouth. Yo, <laughs> I feel like punching you right in your throat. Okay, cover your damn mouth. Now, every time somebody sneezes and they don't cover their mouth, all I see is there was a scene in Outbreak where all the particles flying through the air and getting in your mouth. That's all I see. I'm, I'm gonna need you to cover your mouth because you know this is how you spread germs. Just if you're gonna sneeze, sneeze into they say sneeze into your arm, you know, or sneeze. But just cover your mouth. Like that's nasty. See, I don't. When you, when you said the part sneezing into your arm. No, they usually go like. Nah, I always argue with my other half about it because sometimes I'm aiming for the uh, for the arm, but sometimes the sneeze is so it's faster than my reflex. <laughs> Well, so well, that's I'm a clue trying. that you need to work on some yeah. things. You need to work on some things. But um, sometimes it just you don't make it. But you're talking about the person that just just that's you and just like all over everything. And like, missed. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Ew, that's nasty. Yes. That needs to stop. Kill yourself now. Yes, kill yes. yourself. Kill yourself. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> all right. So my my next one. You ever seen those commercials on TV about? Okay, I'm not a smoker. I'm not a smoker. Don't like cigarettes. Not anymore. Right. No, okay. I've never, We're never, never, been, never been a. Listen, listen. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Really? I got you. I got you. I look, got you. look. So Jamaica. No. Like, like, <laughs> We're talking about cigarettes. Anyway, so now here's the thing. You saw the, you see these commercials with um, the people that are like. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yo. And you try to, and you try to and eat you something, get, right? Yo. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, and, and they got the, and they got the hole in their throat, Word. but they still smoking. Yeah, and you sitting here you like you need to kill yourself because yeah. my thing is if you are still smoking after hold on, I guess it was it if you are still smoking after all of that you got you already got the hole in your throat. This is what it's like. It's not for satisfaction. Yes. Exactly. Like I just don't understand. I don't understand. And you know, I'm in the medical field, and sometimes I see like people coming. You coming in with a damn oxygen tank? Yeah. All right. If you coming in with a why, why, why are you still smoking cigarettes? Y y Yolo. That's what they say. Really? <laughs> okay. Yolo your ass into the grave. Like, come on now. Really? Like, come on, son. But For you, real. Yo, do too. <laughs> but you know, you bring that up, and I and I gotta touch on this. I know it's a little sensitive topic, but my coworker, he was a smoker. He was smoking. I didn't realize how much he was smoking. He was a big time smoker. Yo, I'm sorry. Um, yeah. I'm not saying this is what caused it, but I mean, dude retired like 
You see, June 27th. Okay, that's like a couple weeks ago. Yeah, he passed away like Saturday. Wow. Yeah, he retired and passed away two weeks ago. I'm not saying smoking caused it, but when I see them holes and when I see all of that, I'm good. I'll just stick to alcohol. I'll stick to one poison. Now, alcohol, <laughs> I mean, I'm even controlling with that. I'll just stick to the weekend. I mean, I, I get the alcohol, everything in moderation, but alcohol can also kill you yeah, if you every, everything, yeah. anything that you abuse and take it yeah. to the next level. But I just don't understand. Like you already, you have the hole in your throat. You got emphysema. That that's not that's not cute. Yeah, that's oh, really not that, cute. You think that's enough to be like, all right? This but people, some people are like, I've been smoking all these years, and I ain't got well. Then kill yourself. I'm sorry. Like I'm, it's really you're just killing yourself. Speaking of killing yourself, um, I got set off on this. I think it's Ohio. I don't know which which state. I have. To, I'm gonna get the right state. I'm gonna Google it when we come back. I'll let you know. They switching up the death penalty. What? What? They're not doing the lethal injection no more. They're doing this thing where it's like robotic machines that's just ripping your head off one what? time, and then it has another machine that just breaks it up with a hammer. Like, pow, pow, pow. Well, your head is already ripped so, off, so you're not going to pay No, but they, it's crazy because they said, well, this way is quicker, it's faster, because with the lethal, the, the lethal injection, they actually, like, you know, they cut off your air circulation. It's a lot more um, like, more suffering. So now this is just one time we rip your head off, bam, smack it up with a hammer, psh, and that's it. Yeah, and that's I'm crazy. like, yo. <laughs> <laughs> and before that, <laughs> they offer you a cigarette. Yeah, yeah, this way, your last cigarette. Oh, yeah, your last cigarette. What movie was that, Shawshank? Oh, anyway, but yeah, so so that was I'm sorry, and 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 one other thing I'm gonna say this. Okay, so I'm watching the news and this lady. I'm not trying to offend anybody who's a mother, but you're a jackass. This dumb bitch. I'm sorry. Oh. Now normally I don't, you know, but she lost her baby in a car. Yeah, that's messed up. By accident. How you lock your baby? No, she lost her baby in the car. Oh, she locked the door. She locked the doors oh, okay. with the baby in the car. How you lock the? No, 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 no. That that could happen. How can that happen? That could... I thought you said she left it in the car. No, 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 no. She left. But this is my thing. When it comes to babies, and another thing with animals, I hate to see when people. It's freaking a hundred degrees outside, and you leaving your animal, your pet, in, in the car. That's like a negative. I'll beat your ass if I see it. I don't. I may not know you, but I don't like that. So how she get the baby out? She had to She had to call the police and all it. All it. It was on the news. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. I don't know. It just made me mad. I would do it. You know what I would do it in that situation? No, because I'm finding myself now being a new father. Baby's only two months. I find that like I'm like, damn, I can't just run in the store right now because she's You better bad. not. You know how many stories of people stealing cars with babies yeah. in the back seat? So now you I, find, I find myself like, damn, like I want to go and just grab a quick drink. So nope. now, I'm look, now I'm looking for the drive-throughs. But I could see you locking the baby in the car for real quick by accident. So what I would do, I would just break the window. Because the embarrassment... No, she, called, she called the yeah, fire department and you... Because I would, I would, call and you, I would just be too embarrassed to call somebody. So now everybody's a witness to you being a dumbass. I'm sorry. Clearly, yes. <laughs> Kill yourself. Kill yourself. Now, okay. The last thing. The last thing. Now, you heard about what's going on with the strikes and the uh, LIRR. Oh, We're talking to, to, for the New York people. Yeah, New York people. Um, they're talking about a strike, right? So now, de Blasio, he's supposed to be going on vacation. I'm like, how are you the <laughs> governor and you, you going on vacation in the middle of the strike? <laughs> Yo, I'll be right back, fam. <laughs> yeah, so I'm just like, I'm watching the news. I'm like, um, okay, so we about to Wait. possibly strike. No, but he's mayor. Is he a mayor? He's the main governor. He's a governor. Governor, right? Yeah, he's mayor. the mayor. Okay, mayor. Right. So this fool, this is this is like. And, and then they're talking about. He said that oh, um, how there there's other people, supervisors and stuff who be in charge of the situation, and he'll be in constant contact with them. I'm like, <laughs> you need to get slapped. It's not a, How you gonna go on vacation in the middle of a, like, why don't you wait till the situation is resolved? I mean, I understand everybody, no. the, everybody needs to go on vacation. I get it. No, they but, booked the flight. You booked the flight. What? No, it's Really? Okay, that's, that's enough. That's, it makes that's, you wonder. It makes, like, dang, I need to, I need to get that position. Everything is all messed up, and I could just go on vacation. Yeah. It kind of reminds me of Bush, but anyway, we're not gonna get into that. Oh, and he was smoking cigarettes at Camp David. So, yeah. Um, okay, I got it off my chest. Sorry. Yes. So, so we're done with the set it off right now. 
But, you know, people, come on, get it together. Oh, yeah. Just get it together. Okay? So we want to get into some music. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. yes. And um, when we come back, we're going to, I guess, introduce our guest. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. You know, the surprise guest that, um, that I didn't just, know about that. Just yeah, because sometimes Thank I got to do that. Sometimes I just got to do that. that I got to make sure you on your toes. I got to make sure that Lavi is on her toes, so I somehow I'm going to bring he the surprise guest. He sprung it on me. Oh, I wasn't expecting a guest. I don't need any coaching. <laughs> I don't need yeah, any I kind of already figured tell, that I'm out. I'm going to tell you about this guy when we come back and you'll see why I didn't tell you. All right? Oh, Lord. All There's right. There's a reason. There's we'll a reason right. why I didn't tell you. All right. Oh, Jesus. We'll, we'll be, be right, right back. back. 